Hey guys, Brian here, aka Rack and Vapor, and today I'm here to uh, do a review on the Lunar Mod by V Creations. Okay, so basically, the Lunar Mod is a five piece full mechanical modular mod that can accommodate to uh, three types of batteries at uh, the 18650, the 18490, and the 18350 battery. Okay, so it's modular, meaning it comes with uh, different tubes to accommodate. Uh, different battery configurations all right it's also made out of uh, 304 stainless steel and tiger brass combined giving it a two-tone elegant look so let's start the review by showing you the top cap here it is the top cap of the lunar mod so it's made out of uh, 304 stainless steel it has a thick groove running around the side of the, the top cap and it has a deep juice well and the usual 510 uh, threading which will fit most of your atomizers and a very thick Delrin insulator to prevent the uh, mod from heating up also it has a uh, floating telescopic pin okay um, copper and pure silver combined so it's floating and it's telescopic so that means you can uh, what um turn this uh, silver pin to pull it out more for it to touch the battery if you're using a flat top battery from if you're uh, what switching from a nipple nipple type battery to a flat top battery okay so a flat top battery you can adjust it by by screwing this out more okay so that's a top cap next up we got the upper sleeve also made out of uh, 304 stainless steel okay very thick tube and it has a semi mirror finish okay it, al it almost has a brush finish so um, it's not that shiny but it's nice okay very thick very solid all right so um, next we got the middle tube which is made out of uh, tiger brass so it comes in two two tubes okay one for the 18650 all right and one for the 18490 which will which I'll show you later okay so it has uh, two or four grooves that is running around the middle sleeve two at the top and two at the bottom and four large vent holes for uh, for a very good ventilation battery ventilation okay it's also a thick tube very very solid very durable very solid okay this one is for the 18650 battery configuration so this is for the 18490 same look um, for grooves two at the bottom that is two at the top and four smaller vent holes okay next up we got the uh, the bottom sleeve okay or the lower sleeve um, it's also made out of a 304 stainless steel, very thick tube, um, same finish as the upper sleeve, okay, um, semi mirror like finish, not that shiny, also looks like it has a brush finish, and it has the, uh, the lunar logo, okay, the crescent moon, and the lunar um, engraving, alright. Last but not the least, we got the uh, firing mechanism, which is made out of uh, brass and stainless steel combined. So this has a reverse locking mechanism. If you'll notice, it has a knurling on the on this part, okay, to give you better gripping. If you'll be using the reverse locking mechanism, okay. So um, it has a very soft touch firing button okay pinky friendly and the firing button is made out of uh, brass it has the V creations logo and the serial number if you'll see it okay in my case it has my name on it so it's just personalized that's Brian and my serial number it's 10 okay and it has a silver pin negative pin and a very thick uh, insulator to keep the battery from touching the pin okay to prevent it from firing on it on its own 
All right, so let's assemble this baby and show you the, the performance. By the way, um, the voltage drop of the lunar mod using Sir Oliver Muller's uh, method of uh, getting the voltage drop, okay, using a one ohm build coil, the voltage drop is 0.22. Very uh, a good number for a stainless steel mod. Okay, so the voltage drop is 0.22. All right, so here is the the lunar mod on the 18650 battery configuration. Okay, very sexy, very elegant. Okay, so two toned brass and stainless steel. Okay. Again, I, I mentioned earlier it has the reverse locking mechanism. Okay. So the knurling is for better gripping. All right. And even if you don't lock it, since it has a recess firing button, it won't fire even if uh, you let it sit on sit flat on a table. Okay. Recess firing button. All right. Next up, I'll show you the eighteen. 350 battery configuration so all you have to do is remove the middle tube which makes it a four-piece mod okay so here it is it's almost the size of the 18650 battery all right and last but not the least the 18490 battery configuration which I'll be using today So here's how it looks like on an 18 490 battery configuration. Okay, very nice. Stealth vaping. Okay, so for this review, I'll be using my uh, Crown Atomizer by FMP Pinoy and Dr. Vape's Classic Bliss. Alright, so let me just. Uh, juice this coil up and let's start vaping so um, V Creations is known for the GMS mod this is the second mod that they made okay again it's the lunar mod by uh, V Creations all right okay so we're good to go so here it is, the crown atomizer on the lunar mod. Very nice. I'm using Dr. Vape's classic list. Okay. All right, um, very powerful mod since it has a 0.22 voltage drop. All right, um, what else? Let's talk about the pricing. SRP in the Philippines is 3,800 pesos only. It's a bit expensive than the uh, GMS mod since it's modular. It comes with an, with an extra tube, okay? So it's 3,800 pesos. I'll be posting the Facebook group of V Creations together with the Facebook page of V Creations if you wanna ask about this mod or if you want to order or if you want to try it okay so a couple more vapes before I end this review there you have it my review of the lunar mod by V Creations Again, this has been Aragon Vapor. To all vapors out there, please do vape responsibly. Don't vapor you can't smoke. And vape on.